Hello everybody, this is lollipop 81 mle here today and welcome to another episode, a more comedic episode of Lollipop Speed Art. And this time I am doing a traditional pencil self-portrait of myself. Now, you guys don't know, I mostly do um, characters in my own style. The eyes are a little bit bigger and all that stuff. Like, they have a little bit of a realistic feel, but at least like once a, a few times a year I will do a self-portrait of myself realistically speaking and yes this is myself obviously and I will show you the photo that inspired the self-portrait it was a selfie that I took of myself on Christmas Eve and yeah although it's not exactly like the selfie I took of myself but um, it's close. Here, I'll, I'll, here's the picture right about now. Yep, that is me. Um, that was the day after I turned 22. So, basically, I figured out, like, I had to empty out my trash bin on my phone. So, basically, I had to base it off of, like, get the shadows correct and all that stuff. Now, I could, since this is going to be a talky-talky, mostly video, with some, uh, interruptions as I did this, um, drawing. So, um, what I did was I was doing, like, trying to, like, match the shading, like, the hatching, the cross-hatching, or whatever, and all that stuff. And I learned this when I w I did a lot of... Um, I started doing self-portraits of myself when I was about 18, and, um, the first self-portrait I ever did was, like, not really, like, the- it was a basis, but it wasn't the greatest, because, again, I wasn't really good at doing self-portraits. <laughs> I actually wasn't- I um, wasn't really good at doing realistic, and I am, and I still do- I do realistic, and I do my style, which is awesome. And now that I know how to do proportions and all that stuff, and thanks to my time in figure drawing, it helped out. And one of the, basically one of the most recent things that happened, I did it as an alumni from uh, SUNY Orange. Um, the professor I had for figure drawing, I had her in the fall of 2017, my second year, my second and final year at AUC. Um, uh, she... I didn't know she passed away and yes she was a strict professor but she does she is fair she wants everyone to listen and honestly do a good job oh, that's up in the live drawing yes I drew nudes in figure drawing so that's that and um one of the biggest things here um I was like, I didn't know she passed away. She was a very fair professor. She was strict. She didn't like, she didn't like a lot of talking. She wanted everyone to focus on doing the self, the uh, live drawings. And sometimes when the models were late, um, they, we, we would draw one of our classmates, which is awesome. <laughs> so, basically, one of the first moments in this part of the speed, the speed drawing. I don't, I actually, the basis of Lollipop Speed Art was doing pencil drawings. And if you like look back at my old episodes of Lollipop Speed Art, that's what happened. And now we come to one of the first interruptions of this um, speed drawing. Um, <laughs> let's cue the clip, let's cue the clip. No, no, what are you doing? No, what? I'm trying to do a speed drawing, okay? So after I moved my cat, this happened. What the frick? What? Here, look, I'm, I'm, I'm sharpening this. Look. <laughs> We got it now. Come that on, focus like in. There we go. Come on. 
Oh, okay, that's a little too close here. There we go. Now it's perfect. Back to the drawing. So as soon as I got back to work on doing the self-portrait, I realized, like, I, as I was, after I um, sharpened my pencil and showed what happened, uh, <laughs> this is where I realized, oh, I'm out of focus, hold on, there we go, <laughs> and after that was settled, I went, continued and finished putting the final touches to all of this. So, I use HB, 3B, and 8B pencils for the self-portrait, and also, I hope you enjoyed this funny ass speed drawing episode of lollipop speed art i hope you enjoyed this please subscribe to my channel and also follow me on instagram twitter reddit and uh art, and i'll see you next time peace